Good morning, y'all. My name is Dominique. If you're new, if you're returning, welcome back. So today is Wednesday, April 10th. Um, it's a couple, what's this? Four days since coming back from camping. editing this video and i wanted to add in there that um she did get it removed she had surgery to get the um cancer out uh, so she is fine and better now it's been weeks now since then so um she's doing great she's recovered just fine and she's talking and everything like normal again so yeah i just want to put that in there because i of course they have an update at that time that is what I'm on my way to right now. My appointment's at 10. I'm gonna get there by 9 20 something, so I'll definitely be early. So I'm hoping they can see me earlier or sooner and not wait till my appointment time. So we will see. It is raining. I stopped at Duncan, of course. I got a caramel. Sing the signature latte caramel, toasted caramel, um, the sourdough graphic sandwich. So yeah, I got the medium ice caramel craze signature latte. So it has caramel swirl. Um, I added liquid cane sugar and I added almond milk. Then it comes with whipped cream, cinnamon sugar, and caramel drizzle. That's what it looks like. And then I got the sourdough graphic sandwich. It, has, it comes with two fried eggs, bacon, white cheddar. And this is, this is I didn't know it was going to be this huge. <laughs> if I know it was going to be that huge, I went ahead and got a bagel. I got an everything bagel with plain cream cheese. So I just came back. We just got back home from Walmart. Uh, for Uriah. So Uriah's yes. birthday is tomorrow, April 13th. He will be turning three. One, two, three, four, five things. And then I got him my ice cream cake. I'll show y'all that in a minute. But of course he is ready to open up these gifts. I'm gonna do, we're gonna do the cake and stuff tomorrow. I'm taking the Chuck E. Cheese. Going to Chuck E. Cheese tomorrow. Give me that. And this is another one. So it was actually six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, six days. He likes coca melon. I was trying to find some um coca melon cake. Coca melon cake, like decorations to decorate a cake, but I didn't have no luck in Walmart. So well, the Walmart get... I went to, so I just got a regular cake that said happy birthday. So we just get an ice cream cake. So apparently you can change out the top on these monster trucks. Let's see. Oh, I guess you just. Oh yeah, you so you pressed it button and you just put on a new one. I want to change mine. Yeah, uh, it's not yours. It's your Oh wow, that's neat. Oh wow, that's so neat. <laughs> you just pop it off and want to put a new one. Put a new one. I said put me down. Wow. Mommy, how's the 
man. I thought this was so cute. The little LED inflatable bouncer. Like, that is so cute. And it comes with the um, mommy, pump. Mommy, Look, guys. Drive from and go. Drive from and go back. And it lights up as he bounces. I could get. Oh, Raya. Dang, he's tough. <laughs> Be careful. Don't fall. <laughs> you like it? You like it? I, I think he likes it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Now, don't y'all bounce on that. Oh, we will fall. There you go. Oh, oh. <laughs> be careful. <laughs> it's safe to say he likes it. Let's give a shout out to April. April Abraham. Um, Because she ordered my stud finder. And I've been really needing this. I've been needing to go to the store and get one. But she got it for me. So now I can actually rehang up my curtains. And then she also purchased the second uh second sheet because i had put two of those star sheets on my thing she brought one and she went back and brought the other one so now i have two of those for both of the boys and then i received something else in the mail and packages and honestly i thought <laughs> i'm not gonna lie i thought it was from april but the package said somebody else name on it so I seen once I seen the um the receipt. So I say enjoy your gift from D Grisby. So thank you so much, D. I appreciate you purchasing my my stands and my dresser. I'm about to show y'all. It looks so good. I put it together last night. I love it. So those are my stands. That's how they turned out. I love them. They are perfect. So that's gonna give me like a little mini lamps, the little mini lamps. Gotta be seeing, put those on there, like, yeah, I love it. And then here's the dresser. Y'all done took the TV. Now, I did look on my Amazon. Somebody did purchase the TV. But this is the TV that was in the room, so I put it in here for now. But this is the dresser. And I just love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, oh God. Like, thank you so much. I mean, really, y'all really do not understand. Like, y'all are so helpful. Because, granted, yes, I could get the stuff myself. Granted, yes, I could. But it's going to take me some time to get it. Like, I can't just go and get it. I'm not working. I'm currently job-seeking. Um, so, literally, I'm doing what I can to make sure that the kids are getting provided for. Making sure they're getting stuff they need. And making sure, trying to make sure bills getting paid. So... I truly, 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 truly am appreciative of you all going out, spending your hard-earned money to buy me the things, items that I need for my household. Like, it really means a lot. It means the world to me. And I'm so, so, so grateful. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh, D. <laughs> thank you. And April, thank you. I appreciate this so much, y'all. Um, quick update. So I went to mediation yesterday. Um, so it is official. Your girl is moving back to Maryland. I'm going back home to Maryland. I'm super, super, super excited. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> um, yeah, he didn't fight me on it. Um, only thing he had a problem with with me going back to Maryland is the fact that he won't be be able to attend any of the boys like sporting events or anything like that. But I mean, if I, I mean, if I send you the schedule, I mean, you could plan accordingly, depending on what I mean. Put it back. I mean, put it back. So yeah, that was really the only thing he didn't. His only con he had with me moving back so but yeah your girl is going back to Maryland I'm so excited I cannot wait um I'll be going back the end of July I already spoke to my leasing office because like I told y'all my lease isn't up until November but I'm leaving in July so they told me I just yeah I just gotta get them a 30 day notice 
and I just need to pay a one month termination fee. So I just need to pay a termination fee of one month rent. When when July comes, like, and then that's my birthday month. That's me and Micah birthday month, July. So doing birthdays and trying to move and and it's like I'm still trying to make sure my kids enjoy their birthday. Like my, your eyes only three like he's not gonna remember this but i still want it to be enjoyable i want him to still have fun so you know i went and got the toys the toys that i could get they i mean shoot for five dollars they're still nice uh toys um i'm glad i was able to get him as many as i got him oh i need to show y'all his ice cream cake and i'm blessed to be able to take him to chuck e cheese tomorrow and the other boys, they already telling me stuff they want for their birthday. I'm like, oh, Lord. <laughs> like, I'm just like, y'all know y'all bumping that working right now. I'm like, they asking for a drone and some, what do I get asked for? Okay, I'll change them in a minute. Micah, asking for drones and cameras. And I'm like, <laughs> look, but I want to make sure that I'm able to get it for them and Y'all, I'm just, I'm really, I'm really trying to, I'm really trying to stay positive and look on the bright side. Look on the bright side. I'm not where I was a year ago. And I'm not where I was two years ago. So, I'm in a better space. I'm not in no toxic environment anymore. Like, co-parenting does have its challenges on back on front. They have its challenges. But um, the kids will be going to their dad next weekend. Um, he asked for his bad weekends back until I moved back to Maryland. So the kids will be going over there next weekend. He wanted them this weekend. I'm like, he wants them this weekend because you're our birthday tomorrow. And I'm like, oh, I was going to go ahead. And I was going to drop them all Saturday night once we finished. And I was going to go ahead because he was making it seem like he didn't want them next weekend, which is his weekend. But then he texts me talking about to avoid tension. He'll just wait till next weekend and get them. So, yeah, co-parenting. <laughs> but I'm just glad I'm moving back home. I'm going back home to my mama. The girl is going back to her mama. I'm gonna stay with my mom and just say, save, 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 get my credit right so I can get me and my boys a house. That is my goal, to get my boys. They want, they want their own room. They've been asking me for their own room for the past two years. So, that's my plan. Move back in my mom. Save. Get my credit together. So I can get them their own room. <laughs> and I'm glad I'm able to record this, document this journey because it has not been easy. Going from being a married woman a stay at home married woman at that. Like I was staying at home. I wasn't working. Um, and then when I did go back to work, the only times I worked, honestly, the only time I went to get a job was when he wasn't working. Um, and we ain't gonna get into that. But yeah, that's really the only time I would get a job when he wasn't working. Um, and then when I finally decided to go back to school to get my degree in accounting um, that's when the internship opportunity came about because I had to do an internship part of my program so I was doing that so but going from having someone financially take care of me and my children and the household and the bills like I, I didn't have to worry about any of that so to go from that from six years to now being on my own having to try to find a job again taking care of bills like 
It's a lot. But I'm not the only one doing it. So it's you know, I have a lot of single women, single moms in my support system. So I'm not alone. I know I'm not alone. I'm not the first single mama, I'm not gonna be the last single mama. So I just gotta stay strong, keep pushing, and yeah. It's tough, y'all. It's tough. But hey, but like I said, I'm just happy I'm going back home. I already texted my god sister. I texted my cousin, but she ain't text me back, so I'm assuming she's at work. <laughs> so she'll text me back when she texts me back. And yeah, so y'all. So excited. So, so, yeah, y'all. And my friend, y'all know, like, I told y'all I got a little friend. <laughs> but I told him it's official. I'm moving back to Maryland. Um, I'm up to doing a long, like, I don't, I never done a long distance relationship. And we are, like, we're literally going to be five hours apart. I never did a long distance relationship. I'm willing to give it a try. I can't, I mean, I can't make him do a long distance relationship. Like, I can't just be like, you're going to do a long distance relationship with me. Like, I can't do that. <laughs> but, I mean, we're not boyfriend and girlfriend. Like, we're not together. So, it's like, we were, you know, we're still building that friendship, that connection. And it's been, what, seven months? We met August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, April. Eight months. It'd be eight months, April 19th. So, we met August 19th. So, almost eight months getting to know each other, just being friends. And actually, I like that. Because um, when I met my ex, we literally only knew each other for probably like a week. And we were in a relationship. <laughs> so, um, I'm glad I get, I, I'm being able to build a friendship with someone. But, unfortunately, the friendship might sizzle away because I'm going five hours away. But if it's meant to be, it will be, it will, it will be if it's meant to be. But if not, you know, but yeah, y'all, I mean, show y'all this cake real quick. And then I'm going to catch y'all probably tomorrow when we go to Turkey Cheese. Here's the cake. I ain't even open it. I don't think I want to open it. It's a cake. It's caked up and I don't want to open it, but it's an ice cream cake. And it just say happy birthday on it. So really cute for three to go on top of it. So super cute. Oh, and I went to Target yesterday. So oh, we are, are going. Today? No, we're gonna do it tomorrow. I don't know. It depends. This create your own mask, dinosaur mask kit from no. Target. Yeah, dinosaur mask. No. <laughs> and then I picked I up this create. Oh shoot. Create your own floating ship kit. So, yeah. We're going to do this either tonight or tomorrow. I don't know yet. Depends on how I feel tonight. We might do it tonight if I, don't, if I ain't feeling it. We'll just wait till tomorrow in the morning um, to do that. A clap. <laughs>